Hey guys, what's going on? Honest Abe checking in here on a Saturday. Just want to apologize for uh, not getting the videos out this week. Just had a lot going on. Had a death in Mel's family. And uh, just a lot of other things going on this week. So, haven't been able to uh, get out the videos. But hopefully going to get out a couple over the weekend here. But a uh, good Saturday morning to you. I wanted to bring you guys just a, a quick sports update on some things that have been happening at um, uh, around Tennessee the past couple days and so let's go ahead and get right into it uh, first uh, John Kelly uh, UT running back he had a good uh, uh, combine for the NFL combine so that's good that'll definitely boost his stock for the NFL uh, draft um, rumor has it that uh, Butch Jones has been in talks with Nick Saban and Alabama about being a football analyst so uh, offensive analyst so we'll see what happens there uh, definitely uh, could come come with something here in the next uh, couple of days we'll, we'll definitely see uh, what happens uh, with that um, let's see uh, Keller Chris uh, he is committed to uh, Tennessee he was a um, quarterback at Stanford he is a graduate transfer so he is eligible uh, immediately, which definitely will help Tennessee with uh, their quarterback depth. He played uh, three seasons at Stanford. He played in um, 13 games, or he started 13 games. He played, I think, in 23. He had uh, over 1,900 yards and 19 touchdowns. So definitely uh, a good a good pickup for Tennessee um, with a graduate transfer, and uh, definitely looking to see into what he can do. Uh, for Tennessee. Um, also, uh, news coming out this week out of UT was that uh, Trey Smith, um, Nathan, uh, Nihas, uh, Hall, and uh, Calvert, uh, all offensive linemen, are going to be out for spring practice. So that only leaves about seven offensive linemen, scholarship offensive linemen, for camp. So uh, hopefully these guys can recover quickly from injuries and what's going on. Uh, but uh, Definitely uh, not a good sign starting off uh, for offensive linemen. So hopefully they can get it together. Of course, you know, Trey Smith started as a freshman uh, outright last year. Great. Uh, he's a great player. Definitely don't want to lose him uh, for the season. So definitely need to rest up and heal up uh, for, for fall practices and obviously the season. So get our offensive linemen healed up. Hopefully uh, that will give us a little bit more depth for the season. But uh but yeah, those guys are all out for, for spring camp, so hopefully they can heal up. Um, also, uh, Tennessee beat uh, Mississippi State um, on Tuesday. They beat them 76-54. to I really didn't think that uh, Tennessee would have an issue uh, with Mississippi State. They played well. And, um, you know, they, uh, they got Georgia today at 6 o'clock. Um, and basically... You know, if if they if they beat Georgia, I mean, right now they're tied for with Auburn for first place in the SEC, which is crazy. So, Auburn slipped up the past couple games. Uh, they've lost uh, they lost to Florida, and they lost to Arkansas, and so they play um, they play South Carolina at three thirty today, and if they lose and Tennessee wins, Tennessee will have the number one um, SEC championship outright. Um, so that is crazy talk uh, when you when you think about uh, a number 13 preseason pick uh, for the Vols in the SEC and they've made it all the way to number one uh, but uh, Grant Williams and, and Schofield they've both been playing well uh, down the stretch here which is important take that into tournament time um, here at the SEC tournament and then obviously into uh, the following weeks when we get to see what happens in March Madness. So we'll see where where Tennessee winds up, but uh, definitely looking forward to that uh, for sure. But, you know, if Auburn, if Auburn loses today and, and Tennessee wins against Georgia, uh, it'll be huge. It'll be, it'll be a, a really, really cool um, victory and time to celebrate. Uh, but, yeah, so definitely looking forward to that. Um, today, be watching that. I'll probably be bringing you guys uh, a quick sports update. Um, later on uh this afternoon and evening kind of as the game wraps up or whatnot but anyway this is a mm, pardon me this is honest Abe um signing off for today i hope you guys have a good weekend we'll catch you guys later